Manjango Cave is a UNESCO's World Natural Heritage Site and one of Jeju's most treasured tourist attractions. However, visitors cannot enter the cave during heavy rainfall due to rising water levels inside the lava tube. Researchers have identified the cause and discovered features of rainwater movement underground. Tathaka reports. This is Manjangu Cave after recent typhoons inundated the island with rain. Water gushes from crevices in the cave wall. Yongchan Cave, which is also a part of the Gomun Orum lava tube system, experiences the same phenomenon. Manjangu Cave cannot accept visitors when it rains heavily because of rising water levels inside the lava tube. So, what is the cause of the flow of water into these caves? The Jeju World Natural Heritage Center has studied these lava tubes to identify the cause. It found that an impermeable clay layer helps direct rainwater into the island caves. Rainwater cannot permeate the clay layer between lava beds, so it collects and flows along the layer, like a stream. If there is a crack in the cave wall, water enters the tube. Researchers have identified 14 fissures in Manjango Cave and five in Yongchan Cave, which are found in a line. The research team analyzed the results of a previous drilling survey to determine the association between the distribution and angle of the clay layer and underground water movement. Manjangul은 지표로부터 한 20m 이상 깊은 곳에 위치하고 있고요. 거기서 흘러 들어가는 물들의 양상은 실제로 제주도 지하에 흘러가는 지하로 스며든 물들의 흐름을 관찰할 수 있었다고 생각됩니다. The Jeju World Natural Heritage Center is planning to measure the volume and pattern of water inflow into the lava tubes. Further research is expected to result in more quantitative data that will aid scientists in their understanding of the island's underground water flow. Todd Thacker, KCTV.